Roasting a turkey may seem overwhelming, but there's really nothing to it. Hi, I'm Kristen from the Betty Crocker Kitchens, and I'm going to show you how to make a beautiful bird that you can serve on Thanksgiving or any time of year. If you have a frozen turkey, be sure that it's completely thawed. Remove everything from the inside of the turkey, and then rinse it well with cold water. You can discard the giblets and neck, or save them for another use. Make sure you have the right size roasting pan so the turkey doesn't touch the sides. Here's my roasting pan, and the rack is already in here. Fold the wings across the back of the turkey so the tips are touching. If this isn't done already, tuck the legs underneath and take kitchen string and tie them together. Place the turkey into the roasting pan. Brush the bird with melted butter. This will give flavor and a beautiful crisp skin. Insert an oven-proof meat thermometer into the thickest part of the thigh. I've heated the oven to 325. Roast the turkey uncovered for two hours. And then make a foil tent over the turkey. This will help to prevent overbrowning and keep the meat juicy and moist. And place it back in the oven for the rest of the roasting time. For a 12 to 15 pound turkey, you'll want to roast it for a total of three to four hours. Check the thermometer. It should read 165 degrees to show that it's done. The legs will move easily when twisted. Let the turkey rest for a good 15 to 20 minutes before carving. Look how beautiful this is. You'll be so proud that you made it yourself and your guests will be very impressed.